Hi all, hope you've had a blessed day today. Tonight we continue our countdown the top 100 Christian films of all time. And we are now at number 31, The Left Hand of God, released in 1955. This film stars Humphrey Bogart as James Cromartie. And Humphrey Bogart is one of the greatest American living act, uh, living, listen to me, one of the greatest American actors to ever live. Uh, I don't think he needs any introduction, but I will name some of his highlights. The Maltese Falcon, uh, Casablanca, and, um, uh, well, this one. <laughs> Actually, he was in Angels with Dirty Faces with James Cagney as well. Uh, the film also stars Gene Tierney as Anne Scott. And Gene Tierney uh, had, had done a slew of films between the 40s and 50s. Her most memorable performances were in the movie Laura, uh, Leave Her to Heaven, and um, uh, there was another one that she did, uh, Leave Her to Heaven. Uh, oh, why am I having a brain freeze right now? Uh, Leave Her to Heaven and The Ghost of Mrs. Muir. That was it. Sorry. Um... The film also stars uh, Lee J. Cobb, who we last saw at number 44 in The Miracle of the Bells. And here he is playing General Yang in this film. Uh, it also stars Agnes Moorhead. Does this woman ever smile? <laughs> um, as Brill Sigmund. We last saw her at number 62, The Singing Nun. Um, and again, she didn't smile as a nun either, so... Uh, Agnes Moorhead is most famously known for playing uh, Samantha Stevens' mom in the TV show Bewitched. So, okay, here we go. Left, the Left Hand of God is about a, uh, a World War II uh, pilot, Jim Cromartie, who crash lands in a remote China village and becomes a prisoner and right-hand person to Warlord General Liang. Um, However, when he witnesses the murder of a priest in cold blood by one of Yang's soldiers, he uh, puts on the priest's clothing and decides to pretend that he's him uh, in order to make an escape from General Yang. Uh, however, when he reaches a, a missionary hospital that is where the priest was going, uh, he all of a sudden falls for Anne Scott, who's a nurse there, and then he decides to take on the role of Father O'Shea, who he's pretending to be, and try to save the mission when General Yang decides to attack it. Um, this film is a good film. Uh, it's, 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 it's very much a Humphrey Bogart movie. Um, if you enjoy Humphrey Bogart as much as I do, then you'll enjoy the film. However, if you're not a Humphrey Bogart fan, uh, you're not going to enjoy the film. Uh, it's a good film to pass a, a rainy Sunday. You know, if you have nothing to do and you want to watch a good Humphrey Bogart film, then check it out. But uh, overall, it's okay. It's not great. Um, and like I said, it, unless, you're a, uh, uh, unless you're a fan of Humphrey Bogart, you can pass on this one. So that's number 31, The Left Hand of God. Tomorrow I'll be back with number 30. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you for spending time with me. Thank you for supporting my channel. God bless you all.